15 seconds. 13 seconds. 11, 3, okay. 4. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Zero and lift off of the Delta II with Grail on a journey to the center of the moon. Chamber pressure rising in all six grounded solid motors. Good chamber pressure on the main engine. Good chamber pressure on both burniers. Good chamber pressure on all six groundlet motors. 20 seconds into the flight. We have 29 seconds. Mark 29 seconds, Mach 1, vehicle now going transonic. 35 seconds in. 38 seconds in, max Q, maximum dynamic pressure to the vehicle. Coming up on the 45 second mark. Mark 45 seconds in, altitude 3.4 nautical miles, downrange distance 13.4 nautical miles, velocity 1742 miles per hour. Coming up on the one minute mark. Mark, one minute into the flight, standing by for solid motor burnout, about 10 seconds from now. Pressure decreasing on the solids. Standing by for burnout. And we have burnout, standing by for SEP. And we have separation. And we have ignition on the three airlet motors. The three airlet motors have come up on chamber pressure. Chamber pressure on the airlet motors. One minute, 39 seconds into the flight. The Delta vehicle now only weighs about one half of what it did at launch, expelling propellant now at the rate of about 2,700 pounds per second. One minute, 50 seconds in. Altitude now 21.8 nautical miles, downrange distance 51 nautical miles, velocity 4,493 miles per hour. About 30 seconds now remaining on our three airlit motors. Chamber pressure is beginning to decline. We have a good engine control in the main engine, good engine control in the verniers, settling down from the initial launch transients. Standing by for burnout of the three airlet motors. And we are we have burnout. Standing by for separation. And we have separation. Separation on the airlet motors. Now two minutes fifty seconds into the flight. Altitude now 41.7 nautical miles, downrange distance 130.7 nautical miles, velocity 7,761 miles per hour. Three minutes into the flight. Smoother ride now, main engine pitch and yaw control is good. Well within our ability to control, vernier engine pitch and yaw control is good. Three minutes, 15 seconds. Chamber pressure holding very well in the first stage. Main engine chamber pressure right where we want it to be. Vernier engine control and chamber pressures right where we want them to be. Coming up 3 minutes 30 seconds. Mark 3 minutes 30 seconds. Now at Mach 15. Less than 1 minute until main engine cutoff. Vehicle now at uh, 59.7 nautical miles. Downrange distance 240.3 nautical miles. Velocity... 10,000, correction, now 11,281 miles per hour. Coming up on the four-minute mark. Mark, four minutes into the flight. Less than uh, 20 seconds now until main engine cutoff. Four minutes, 15 seconds in. Standing by for main engine cutoff about five seconds from now. We have Miko standing by for Vernier cutoff. And we have Vernier cutoff, stand by for one, two, SEP. And we have one, two, SEP. And ignition on the second stage. 
Good ignition on the second stage. And we have fairing separation. Good fairing separation. Four minutes, 50 seconds in. Up four minutes, 55 seconds. All looks good. Good engine control in the second stage. As we pass five minutes, five seconds, altitude now 80 nautical miles, downrange distance 504 nautical miles, velocity 15,135 miles per hour. Five minutes, 15 seconds in. This uh, first burn of the second stage today uh, will last about uh, two and a half minutes. Coming up five minutes, 28 seconds in. Altitude now 84 nautical miles, downrange distance 588 nautical miles, velocity 15,440 miles per hour. Five minutes, 40 seconds in.